Hello, and this is Mr. Fuzzy Panda, and welcome to my second episode of my Gears of War 3 weapon guide. Today, we are covering the Locust Assault Rifle, the Hammer Burst. The Hammer Burst 2 is a Locust weapon with a variable firing rate and has the lowest magazine capacity of all the assault rifles with a meager 20 rounds. However, it features usable iron sights unlike any other weapon. Its availability is high because it's one of the starting weapons. In game, the Hammer Burst features a variable firing rate. The trigger can be held to fire a steady but slow stream of bullets, or one can markedly increase the firing rate by tapping triggers as fast as you can. With its high damage, firing semi auto greatly increases your damage output and can become quite fearsome. Beware, however, you do lose some accuracy because of the ad recoil, but the already impressive accuracy of the Hammer Burst doesn't really make this an issue. Because of these traits, the Hammer Burst is best used for medium and long ranges. This is where the Hammer Burst shines. However, you can use it in close range but it's not recommended as the Hammer Burst lacks any close core combat attachment unlike the Lancer and the Wretched Lancer. The one trait that the Hammer Burst has that no other weapon does is that it has usable iron sights. To use them, just aim down and click the right stick and you will enter aim down sights mode. Accuracy is greatly increased while aiming down the sights and the Hammer Burst range becomes amplified. However, you lose some of your peripheral vision around you, so make sure you are aware of your surroundings. With the variable firing rate, there is a massive potential for damage. With a fast enough trigger finger and accuracy, you can down the player surprisingly quick in a matter of seconds. This will help the hammer burst in close ranges. Given enough space, you can stand still while firing to greatly increase your accuracy and destroy your opponent. Again, the biggest drawback of the hammer burst is that it lacks any kind of close course enhancement. But the Hammer Burst has incredible power that will stand more of a chance in personal engagements, but the odds are against you. Overall, if you are a player who has great accuracy and prefers not to get very close, the Hammer Burst is the most fitting option. However, if you lack the accuracy, you may not be able to tame the power of this incredible weapon. You will find time and time that you will down your opponents very fast with the incredible power of this weapon, and is sure to be fit. This has been Mr. Fuzzy Pan. I hope you guys like this episode of Gears of War 3 Weapon, guys. Stay tuned next time when I bring you the Retro Lancer. See ya. Please hit that like button because I take a lot of time into making these. And subscribe too because there are more to come. And if you already haven't seen my Lancer Weapon Guy, uh, there will be a link right now. Click on that to go watch that. And join me next time when I cover the Retro Lancer. Hey guys, you watched till the end, now you get the bonus tip. The bonus tip of the hammer burst is you can reload it actually faster if you reload it right when you can get a successful reload instead of getting a perfect reload. So I hope that makes sense, sorry I don't have any footage, but just try it out. I'll see you guys later, bye.